Hello, my name's Samuel Keith Harris. I just wanted to mention that my books are out now on Amazon. So if you search Samuel Keith Harris, you'll find my first three books there. Thanks for watching. I have recited aloud all the regulations you have given us. I, that speaks of speaking the word of God. May we speak the word of God. May we recite aloud the word of God and the regulations of God and the commands of God. All the regulations you've given us, I've recited them aloud. I have rejoiced in your laws as much as in riches. Now, can you say that one? I have rejoiced in your laws, God, as much as in riches. Or do we, or do we rejoice in riches and when we prosper financially, but, but not in the laws of the Lord? May, may our hearts soar to, in enjoyment to the laws of the Lord as sinners do when they increase in riches. Like how a sinner gets excited about riches. May we get excited about the laws of God. May they stir our heart. May they move our heart. May, may our hearts be tender and overwhelmed with desire for God when we see the commands of God. Even when they convict us. I pray that the power of the Holy Spirit and the power of the Holy Scriptures would convict us, pierce our hearts, and change us to where we delight in the hard truths of the Word of God. And we don't want to stay away from them. I have rejoiced in your laws as much as in riches. Verse 15. So, now what? Since you rejoice in the laws as much as in riches, now what? I will study your commandments and reflect on your ways. Because I rejoice in your laws as much as in riches, I'm going to study your commandments, God, and I'm going to reflect on your ways. I'm going to be meditating on your ways, God. I'm going to be thinking about them because I want to obey you, but I want to do it with my whole heart. I want to delight in it. Now, 